you might get a hand in shot. And uh, what you can do is just step through your frames, find that frame with the hand in it, and press the delete key on your keyboard, and that'll hide the frame. You can also right click on the image and choose hide frame. And now when you play it back, it plays back correctly. If I click editor, I can see here all my frames in a thumbnail view. I can change the size of the thumbnails and I'll bump that up to large. And here's that frame earlier with my hand in it. Let's say I wanted to repeat this sequence of frames. I could just come in on the actions palette here, select repeat selected sequence, click OK. Just change that view to small. If I double click on the first frame and click play, I can see my sequence is repeated twice. I'll go back into the editor, choose the, that frame there and the last frame by holding down the shift key. The control key will also let me select one extra frame and I'll reverse the order of that sequence, the end of the sequence. And so now when I play the animation back, I get a nice little cycling action.